Reach shape is an important tool to know in your hatch embroidery software. Chances are when you digitize a shape, you might need to modify or reshape that object later. Reshape is used to modify the shape of an object, the stitch angle of an object, and the start and end sewing point of an object. When you reshape an object, you will see different colored points and nodes. The yellow square represents a straight reshape point. The blue circle represents a curved reshape point. A small pink square represents a stitch angle handle. The green diamond represents your start sewing point and the red cross represents your end sewing point. Let's take a look. There are several different ways to access the reshape tool for your object. First, you can select the reshape icon in your toolbar, then select the object you want to reshape. However, if your object is already selected, you can press the H key on your keyboard to enable reshape. Let's explore each of the reshape functions. First of all, to change the shape of an object. You can change the shape of an object by selecting a reshape point and dragging on screen. You can also toggle a reshape node between a straight node and a curved node by selecting the reshape point and pressing the spacebar on your keyboard. You can also add additional reshape points by clicking on the outline of the object. To add a straight reshape point, use your left mouse button. Or to add a curved reshape point, use your right mouse button. At any point in time, you can delete a reshape point by selecting the node and pressing delete on your keyboard. Now let's look at stitch angles. To reshape a stitch angle for your object, select the pink stitch angle handle and simply drag it on screen. When you release your mouse, the new stitch angle will be generated. Likewise, you can delete existing stitch angles by selecting the stitch angle node and pressing delete on your keyboard. Finally, we have the start and end sewing point. The start point is represented by this green diamond. The end point is represented by this red cross. So my design sews here and finishes here. To change your start and sewing end point, select reshape and drag the green diamond for your start point and the red cross for your end point. Now my design sews like this. And that's reshape in hatch embroidery. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.